who or what you give your effort to, who and what I don't give my effort to. Hello, y'all. I'm Diana Breanne. Well, I got to thinking about effort, and I've talked along this line or these lines before about who we give effort to and who we don't give effort to. You know, there are people that I give effort to that I will inconvenience myself for, people that I will step out for, and there are people that I won't. And generally speaking, the people that I don't give effort to are the people that would not give effort back to me. Now, sometimes we need to give effort towards situations or people that don't necessarily give back effort towards us, and yet, because there's um, a reward, so to speak, in our giving that effort, um, then, then we give effort to that situation or to that person. And, you know, even situations that we invest in, that we put our time and energy in, we want to see a reward. We want to see um, something given back. Now, granted, there are times and situations that we put forth effort with no expectation back. Perhaps we're helping someone and we feel led and that it's our place to help them. And that's perfectly fine. We're not talking about situations like that. But we're talking more along the lines of maybe relationships that don't make effort towards us. And we're always the one making an effort towards that relationship. Maybe we're the one always doing all the giving and they're doing all the taking. Perhaps it's a situation that's taking up our time and we're giving all this effort and there's no reward for it. And so I believe in being selective about what I give my effort to, what I give my effort to and who I give my effort to. From my house to yours, may God bless you and I hope to talk to you soon again. And I do hope you like, share, subscribe. Hope to talk to you then. Bye-bye.